Let's talk about mandatory variable. When you perform an activity, you must do certain steps to complete that activity. Some of the steps may be optional or good to do, but some of the steps are must. Unless you complete those steps, you cannot complete the activity. For example, checking pressure every 30 minutes or taking temperature sample every 20 minutes. These are some of the examples that can be considered as mandatory checks depending on the processes. Plant applications allows you to do those mandatory checks before allowing you to complete the activity. Let's see how it works. In activities app, when you perform an activity, you will notice a drop down list on the header tab showing filter options to choose from all variables, dynamic variables and mandatory variables. I can select mandatory variables to see what all variables I need to capture to complete this activity. As my pre-work for this demo, I have kept two variables as mandatory checks and these are having test frequency as one, so they will be stubbed on every event. Now, what happens when I capture all other test values, either automatically by historian tag or manually by entering those values, but I do not capture mandatory variables test values. And I hit back button assuming that my activity should be complete, but no. Please observe that my activity completed percentage is still zero. And I do not have a complete button to complete the activity. Now I'll go back to this activity. I will use this filter to filter out only mandatory variables that are required to complete this activity. I see these are the two variables. I need to check census and I need to sign on the final checks to complete my mandatory check activity. I select this activity as pass because I have e-signature configured. I will approve this as a performer. Out of the two variables, I have captured one variable. If I click on back button, you will notice that my activity is completed percentage is 50%. I am still not allowed to complete the activity. I'll click on activities again. I'll go and fill value for the next variable as well. I say final check is passed. Again, I have e-signature configured. I'll verify my transaction for e-signature. Click on approve. I have entered both the values now. I click on back. Now you will observe that the, my activity completed percentage is 100% and I have a complete button enabled to complete this activity. Click on complete button and this activity is completed. This is how plant application helps you not to miss any mandatory checks while you perform an activity. Thank you for watching this video.